Hey, my girls, listen. God placed something on my heart this morning. I want to share it with you um, because I'm intentional. I brought the camo out. Okay, I brought the big hoops out because we are at war. We are at war. The enemy is always at combat with us in the battlefield of our mind. So we got to keep our mind stayed on God. We got to stay in the Word. So I want to share a little bit. And I pray that you'll take this in. God is doing something different with Thursdays. So I appreciate y'all still walking with me, still having your ear tuned in to what God is saying through me and knowing that he's ushering us into a place of obedience and to a place of receiving because he is pouring out. You understand? So let me share. I'm going to read verses one through four of Psalm 39, of course, New Living Translation. I want us to listen to what David is saying. This is what he said. I said to myself, I will watch what I do and not sin in what I say. I will hold my tongue when the ungodly are around me. But as I stood there in silence, not even speaking on good things, the turmoil within me grew worse. The more I thought about it, the hotter I got, igniting a fire of words. Lord, remind me how brief my time on earth will be. Remind me that my days are numbered, how fleeting my life is. And immediately when I was reading that this morning, I thought about a song that takes me up. I mean, sends me to heaven every time. I will not be silent. I will always worship you as long as I am breathing. I will not be silent. I will always worship you. And David right here, look at this. He was trying not to say the wrong thing because David, listen, David will tell folks off. He will sick God on people. God knocked their teeth out their mouth. God, I'm sick of these people. He will praise God in one moment. And in the very next moment, he want to cut somebody's throat off. And he tried to button up that anger, that rage in him. And he said, I'm going to just completely shut it down. But in completely shutting it down, he shut down the praises. And he said it ignited a fire in him. One of the prophets says, like, fire shut up in my bones. So David said, I can't properly war if I can't praise. I want to say that again to my sister queens, to whoever might hear this. You feel free to share this. I can't properly war if I can't 